Saginaw County plans could move forward today on a new home for a struggling animal shelter. Our Mikhail Evans joins us live in Myrtle Beach with new details on the possible lifeline for the Grand Strand Humane Society. Michaela, good morning. Good morning, Lauren and Darion. Santee Cooper could bring some light into the animal shelter's future. It says it has extra land the Humane Society could use to build a new home. The animal shelter has been without a permanent home since a 2021 pest infestation. And without a plan since pushback this summer forced them to scrap the proposal to build a facility on River Oaks Drive. But Santee Cooper has several options, including around five acres near the Myrtle Beach Airport. The city is even weighing giving the Humane Society half a million dollars dollars to get started. Both offers are something that Humane Society's executive director Jess Winook tells me could not come any sooner. The Horry County has grown so much in the last 50 years and our building has not so we really need to catch up and have enough space to house these animals appropriately. Winook says once they close on a property, they hope to have a new 38,000 square foot facility built within two years. But today, Myrtle Beach City Council and Horry County Council will vote on Santee Cooper's proposal to get the ball rolling and we'll make sure to keep you updated. Live in Myrtle Beach, Michaela Evans, WMBF News.